Today we look at the best festivals and events you can find during the summer season in Rotterdam. These include both paid and free entry events. And I will focus on the ones that come back each year. So if you see this video in a later stage, this is no problem at all. Number one is a very cool festival called The Parade. This is really a nice collective of actors, artists, musicians that have all kinds of performances in smaller tents within the colorful location of the festival itself. This festival actually visits the four major cities of the Netherlands and is really fun. On the terrain all kinds of things are happening with also lots of music and food trucks to keep you entertained and well fed. Within the terrain you choose which performance you would like to visit and then you buy the ticket for it. All the performances are for smaller audiences so it is very intimate. You will see a performance with maybe 25 to 50 persons in total. This is possible because they have their acts several times in the day. It also starts in the beginning of the afternoon and goes on till midnight. This year it takes place from the 29th of June until the 8th of July. And it's kind of the start of the entire festival season for Rotterdam. Number 2 is the North Sea Jazz Festival. The North Sea Jazz Festival is definitely one of the best music festivals with a lot of major artists. In previous editions artists such as Prince and Mary J. Blige have performed here. But also a lot of other top artists within the world of funk, jazz, R&B and soul music. The festival takes place indoors in the large concert halls of Ahoy in Rotterdam South. And this is a paid festival. It takes place from 13th to 15th of July and there will be 1300 musicians and 15 concert halls to enjoy. Some of the artists that will be there this year are The Roots and CeeLo Green, Maxwell, Emily Sandé, Earth, Wind and Fire, Ello Black and NERD. Visiting this festival is a guarantee for success. Number 3 is the Tropical Summer Carnival, also known as Rotterdam Unlimited. Now this is really a big event in Rotterdam. A strong recommendation if, if you want to have an epic day in Rotterdam during the summer. There is a huge carnival parade with hundreds of dancers, music and colorful decorated floats. But also lots of incredible food stands and other nice to have things to buy. Everywhere throughout the city there are stages with awesome concerts with especially a lot of Caribbean and Latin music. The name of the event is Rotterdam Unlimited and it's a merger of two festivals. On a Friday Rotterdam is warmed up with a battle of the bands where drum bands show their best skills And then Saturday the parades and concerts take place, really a stunning event. This year the entire event takes place from the 24th until the 28th of July. Number 4 is called Duizel in het Park. Duizel in the Park. This is a nice festival in the locally popular Frusen Park on the north side of Rotterdam. It is not for free but you can get a ticket for just about 5 euros. It contains a nice mix of theater, music, art, literature with an inspiring surrounding of parks and tents. You can sit in the grass and enjoy the music. This festival exists for 10 years now. The lineup is very diverse. You can hear music ranging from electronic to folklore. It's about 10 to 15 minutes walking from Central Station or you take the metro to Station Blijdorp. Very easy. Number 5 is the Plein Bioscope. This is the outdoor cinema. If you want to enjoy the cinema outside during summer nights in a nice city park environment, this is the place to be. And we watch movies in their original language with subtitles so you can also see them no problem. This is the biggest open air cinema event of Europe and takes place all the weekends in August with all kinds of movies from this year, ranging from blockbuster movies to more art house type movies. So there is choice for everyone. Tickets are usually just a couple of euros and you can rent a chair for one euro. Number 6 is the Day of the Romantic Music. The Day of the Romantic Music is a great way to experience the park near the Euromast. There are several stages in the park with the finest classical music. People really like to dress up for this event, so you will see a lot of stylish hats and outfits. Bring your own picnic basket or enjoy some of the nice foods the festival also offers. Besides music there is also room for romantic poems and for instance tango dance performances. It is the oldest and biggest classical music festival in Rotterdam. This year it takes place on the 19th of August and you can take the metro to the station Dijkzicht to get there very easily. Number 7 is the Street Theatre Festival. This is the Welcome Home Street Theatre Festival. It takes place on a very nice location of Katendrecht, 
where you can find a number of hotspots also, such as the Phoenix Food Factory and the SS Rotterdam, the cruise ship that is open for everyone. All kinds of talent will take over the streets for the day of cool music, theater and dance. This event is for free and takes place on Saturday the 25th of August. Besides shows there are also all kinds of fun workshops, so it's also nice for interaction. The most interesting way to get there is to get out at metro station Wilhelminaplein and then walk up to the Hotel New York where you can find a bridge that leads you to your destination. Number 8 is the Roof event. Roof is a very nice event and as the name says, you know, it takes place on a roof. It's especially a nice event in a place with such a vivid skyline. It's on the roof of a parking site on the corner of the famous Witte de Wit Street, which is one of the best streets in Rotterdam to eat and drink. It is called a pop-up city park where you can enjoy live shows, DJs, music and dance, food and drinks with marvelous rooftop view. There are even grills where you can prepare your own foods and there are games to play such as ping pong. It's all just a very relaxed and fun way to enjoy the summer. There are plenty of opportunities to go there because it's open from the 21st of July until the 31st of August and is open every Wednesday until Sunday. This year they will have their 5 year anniversary. You can easily get there by taking the metro to station Burrs, which is the main shopping area where most people get out and walk 5 minutes from there. Number 9 is the World Harbor Days. If you are still in Rotterdam, at the end of the season you can enjoy this ultimate Rotterdam event, which are the Harbor Days. This is a 3 day festival, it's very close to its core business. There are all kinds of marines and navy shows and workshops which are very spectacular. Imagine marines with speedboats, chasing enemies, supported by helicopters, large ships you can take a look on, tours you can take into all kinds of companies and harbor areas of Rotterdam, but also music concerts and fireworks. And everyone who has a boat is joining the event on the river, which also makes it very fun to see. It always takes place in the beginning of September and this year in the weekend of 7 to 9 September. Number 10 is Rotterdam Rave. This is Rotterdam's popular techno festival and it's a paid festival that takes place on the Lloyd Multiplane on the west side of Rotterdam on Saturday the 18th of August. So if you want a day full of explosive beats, this is something for you with a lineup with international and Dutch top DJs. Number 11 is the Veerhaven Concert. Finally, for our list today, I have for you the Veerhaven Concert. The Veerhaven is a part of a beautiful historic Rotterdam, including traditional sail ships and yachts. Surrounded by the nostalgic classical buildings that survived the Second World War, there are also statues of some of the most important figures of Rotterdam from the past. So the Veerhaven Concert is a classical concert performed by a gigantic philharmonic orchestra that consists of 130 men and various classical singers. They perform on a large floating stage on the water, where the public can follow everything from the shore. In front of the show people are also enjoying the show from their boats. For this event that takes place on the 25th of August a program is created that includes works from well-known composers such as Verdi and Poncelli. This concert can be enjoyed for free. So these are my picks of the Rotterdam festivals. There are many others so if you want to check out which ones you can choose from just go to rotterdamfestivals.nl Make sure to subscribe to the channel for all the ins and outs about the Netherlands, Dutch language and culture and I hope to see you next time.